hey what's up guys welcome back to another video and in this video i am gonna show you how can you revert back your any samsung device to stock firmware if you guys are rooted then also this method will work out and if you guys are not rooted if you have messed up with your phone and your device doesn't boot you can follow this guide to revert back to stock so guys and this few things are required all those things i'll mention in the description below and i'll also provide you the links from where you can download and make sure that you download the latest version of those files so first of all what you need to do is right now i'm using my samsung galaxy s8 plus and this is an uh, xns variant so for this what you need to do is you need to go to settings and under settings you go to about after that software information here you need to tap build number 7 times to enable developer mode so i have already enabled it i just go back go to developer option and in this what i do is i enable usb debugging so make sure to enable this and if you guys are if your device doesn't boot up I'll tell you what needs to be done if your device is not booting up or you have messed up with the firmware these are the things required if your device is in working condition and you have some issues with the de device and you need to flash latest firmware so we'll be using Odin to flash the latest firmware I'll tell you how can you download that because uh, if you download from sammobile.com uh, then you have a very low speed if you're not a premium member so this method which I'll be showing you you can download at a very good speed and uh, without any kind of limitations so let's move to my PC first so in this you can see I have few files available here that is Odin Sam firm this is a file which we require to download the firmware the latest firmware of your device so for that what you have to do is so on your device you, uh, you need to check uh, what's the model number that you can check it in uh, settings and the region which your device belongs to if it is India you can choose INS so first what I'll do is I'll open Sam firm and I'll give administrator rights over here so once this is open what you will get something like this you need to put your model number as this is my model number SM955 FD and region is India here what I'll do is I'll select auto and also make sure you select these two options here so once this is done you hit check for update so after few seconds uh, you will get a uh, file name and along with the size so you can see this is the file and this is the latest update for my samsung galaxy s8 plus so after that make sure you have uh, both these boxes decrypt automatically and the first one after that just hit download and the download should complete uh, according to your internet speed I won't be downloading this because I have already downloaded the file and I'll show you the files this is the file which is downloaded here once it is downloaded right click and extract this file and one more thing guys make sure to use WinRAR software to extract the file and sometimes if I use some different software I get lots of issues so this is the file this is the latest file which I have downloaded and after extracting I have these uh, total 5 files available here so once everything is set up open Odin and run as administrator and now you need to connect your device here and once your device is connected give permission always allow for from this computer so once this is done and you'll get a blue box available here it means that your device has been connected so after device is connected then what you need to do is you need to manually put all the files here so I'll just show you I select bootloader and I select this file so this is a older version I think so this is a new version which I have downloaded so I select this file open so these uh, file takes little time I'll just skip these steps and once done I'll get back to you guys and when you select CSC make sure to select CSC OXM not home CSC so I select this over here and now everything is done so what I'll do is I'll first reboot my device to fast boot mode so first I'll power off the device and once the device is power off I'll hold volume down along with the Bixby button and power button all together so 
so you'll see something like this blue screen and you have a warning over here so it says volume up to continue volume down to restart so I'll just hit volume up and you will have all the information available here and which says downloading so after that what you need to do is you need to again connect your device and you can see on my PC again the blue box appears it means my device has been connected in fast boot mode so now I just have to hit start here and once the process is completed I'll get back to you guys So once the process is completed you will see something like pass on your computer screen after this you don't require your PC anymore so let's move on my device and you can see installing system updates this will erase complete data so guys I just forgot to tell you that make sure to uh, take a backup I'll mention that at the starting of video so your device will boot up in somewhere around uh, 4 to 5 minutes you can just complete the initial setup once the initial setup is completed I'll show you about device so as the initial setup has been completed i'll just take you to settings and i'll take you to about phone software information so here you can see uh, my device is on the latest version and uh, boots up without any kind of issue everything is working fine now uh, all the apps are getting installed so this is the way how you can recover your device or if you have messed up with the device you can recover using Odin so this is the safest way and if you face any kind of issue do let me know in the comment section below or else you can drop a message on my facebook page where i can revert you within some time so as of now that's all in this video guys hope you like the video if you like the video do give me a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel do not forget to subscribe to the channel thanks for watching have a great day